How do the rich and famous afford to live the luxury life? From sprawling mansions and yachts to six-figure cars, these things can come at a hefty price tag. For celebrities, business executives and the rest of us who are wealthy by normal standards, though, it's possible to get most of the luxuries we want without spending all our hard-earned money on them. Follow this guide on how to enjoy the luxury life on a budget and you'll be cruising in your own private yacht in no time. Inexpensive cars will cost you more in maintenance, insurance and gas. Drive luxury cars and you'll have fewer car-related problems overall. That will leave you with extra money to spend at nice restaurants and relaxing vacations at your villas or yachts. It's easier than it sounds. Try these 10 tips for buying and using luxury items without breaking your budget.
Making money is hard work and it can often seem like there's not enough time in a day for everything. However, there are some simple steps you can take that will allow you to make money faster, while spending less time doing what you hate. Here are four ways how. Rich people have it all. The cars, the villas, and of course, everything that comes along with them. The problem is these luxuries are expensive. However, there are plenty of ways for you to experience luxury for less. All you need is a little motivation and some smart planning. Here are three things rich people don't have.
Money is power. The more money you have, typically, the more luxurious life you can live. Rich people aren't born rich, they make it so they can live luxuriously. Here are three things rich people do that make them even richer. I was enjoying lunch at Cheesecake Factory in NYC when an Asian man about my age, mid-thirties, came up to me and introduced himself. He told me that he works for Chase, loves luxury cars and how his goal is to own one. After talking with him for several minutes, I realized that we had something in common. Owning expensive things can be fun but it doesn't make you happy. Instead of focusing on luxury cars, villas and boats like he did, he chose to focus on living life well. It made me think.
What if everyone thought this way? We would have more rich people who are happy instead of just rich people who don't know what happiness is because they never experience anything else. When someone talks about how they love luxury cars I ask them what's their favorite thing to do outside of driving their car. If all they can answer is drive their car, then I know that person has bought into the idea that buying cars makes them happy which is sad because cars will break down and go out of style.